Welcome to the tutorial video of Ultra Mode 3 Mapping and Planning Mapping Firstly, use Phantom 4 RDK to complete the mapping of the operation area. Import pictures into the computer for 3D reconstruction. After mapping, insert the SD card from Phantom 4 RDK into the computer. Open DJI Terra. Select New Mission and select 2D map. Name the mission. Click OK. Click Add Picture icon. And select the pictures shot just now. Click Open. As well, you could click Add Folder icon. And select the folder you want. Click Select Folder. Select 2D map in the Reconstruction tab. Fruit tree in the mapping scenes. And high in the resolution. Click Start Reconstruction. It will take some time to finish the reconstruction. Please be patient. Modify result. Open display result. If some objects in the map has not been recognized successfully or correctly, they could be modified here. Modify Result tabs. Select Continuous Spring in the Spring tab. Select Modify Result. Select different size of paintbrush based on the object size. Select Object tabs which need to modify. Hold the control key in your computer, meanwhile drag the mouse. And use the paintbrush to completely cover the object which to be modified. If an obstacle is required to add, select pull. Here we select building in this case. After modifying, click OK and save it. Modify Tree Crown Center. Select Spot Spring in the Spring tab. Select Modify Result. If you want to cancel a tree crown, click this Crown Center and click Delete icon in the top right corner. If you want to add a tree crown center, click Add Spring Spots icon in the Editing tool and click the wanted tree crawl. Click OK and save it. 3D route planning. In a high definition map after reconstruction, different spring tabs and flight route plan tabs can be selected based on the fruit tree distribution. When it is continuous spring, the aircraft will turn on the spring system in the whole journey in fruit tree area. When it is spot spring, the aircraft will only turn on the spring system on the top of the fruit trees. Continuous spring, distance interval auto. Select continuous spring in spring tab and distance interval auto in flat loot plan tab. Select waypoint in the mission area planning. Click the left mouse button to add waypoints and plan the operation area. Add a calibration point in an obvious point which is easy to take off. Click Generate 3D Flat Loot. Select to turn on or off Display Result and Display Routes. If there are obstacles like pole in the field, turn on Enable Obstacle Sensing Adjust Root Attitude Flat Root Width Root Angle and Terrain Flow Accuracy The higher the terrain flow accuracy, the worse the terrain flow situation and the smoother the routes. Continuous Spring Tree Crown Center Auto Select Continuous Spring in Spring tab. 
and two Crown Center Auto in Flatwood Plan Park. At Wee Point and Calibration Point in the Operation Area, click Generate 3D Flat Loop. Turn on or off Enable Obstacle Sensing. Adjust Root Attitude, Flat Loop Width, Root Angle, and Terrain Flow Accuracy. Continuous Spring, Semi-Automatic Select Continuous Spring in Spring Tab and Semi-Automatic in Flat Loot Plan Tab Select Waypoint in Flat Loot Planning Add Waypoints along Fruit Tree Distribution using the leftmost button Loots will be generated automatically in order The Waypoint position can be jacked when it is long placed by the left mouse button and a new waypoint can be inserted by clicking using the left mouse button when root planning is finished click calibration then add it in an obvious point when it is easy to take off select root preview in 2d root preview the loops will automatically adjust to the tree centers at a nearby key turning point and generate the final routes. After confirming no errors, click back to edit and click generate 3D flat route. Turn on or off, enable obstacle sensing. Adjust route attitude and terrain flow accuracy. Continue spring manual. Select Continuous Spring in Spring tab and Manual in Flat Loot Plan tab. Add weapons based on the distribution trend of fruit trees. Then add a calibration point in an obvious point which is easy to take off. Click Generate 3D Flat Loot. Turn on or off, enable obstacle sensing. Adjust root attitude and terrain for accuracy. Spot spring, tree crown center, auto. Select spot spring in spring tab. And tree crown center, auto in flat root plan tab. Add waypoint and calibration point in the operation area. Click generate 3D flat root. Turn on or off, enable obstacle sensing. Adjust root attitude, flat root width, root angle, and terrain flow accuracy. Spot spring, semi automatic. Select spot spring in spring tab and semi automatic in flat root plan tab. Add weapons based on the distribution trend of fruit trees. Then add a calibration point in an obvious point which is easy to take off. Select root preview in 2D root preview. The loops will automatically adjust it to connect to all tree centers within 1.5 meters of the root connecting waypoints and generate the final routes. After confirming no errors, click back to edit and click generate 3D flat loot. Turn on or off, enable obstacle sensing. Adjust route attitude and terrain flow accuracy. Export 3D routes. Long press the left mouse button to check the position of the high definition map. Long press the right mouse button or turn the middle mouse wheel to zoom the map size. Long press the middle mouse wheel to adjust the 3D root viewing angle. After confirming no errors, click export to DJMG icon. Select export routes. Click OK to export the 3D route into the SD card. Thanks for watching.